the date is the first January 2024. The day is Wednesday. The time is 10.40am in the morning, England time, and 2.40am in the morning, Neo Standard time. I'm going to find out what my weekly reward is for this week. I've re-rolled my weekly reward four times in a row. I hope I don't have to re-roll my weekly reward for a fifth time in a row today. Every time I re-roll my weekly reward, I'm missing out on profit from restocking at the Neopian shops because the daily task for every every day and every weekly reward is to purchase an item, one item at the minimum, from one of the Neopian shops. And it's half price day today as well, so it makes it even worse, missing out on profit from restocking. So these are my daily rewards for the daily tasks. Purchase an item from any Neopian shop, just one item, 7,000 Neo points. Griefer, spin the wheel of knowledge in Brightvale. Play a classic game, 1,500 Neo points. Feed any food item to one of your Neo pets, 5,000 Neo points. And groom one of your pets, Altered or Cook magazine. So I'm hoping I don't have to re-roll because I'm missing out on profit from restocking. I don't want to have to re-roll my weekly reward five times in a row. I'm hoping for a spring gift basket or an item that's worth around one and a half million neo points I might accept. Also the mystical, I think it's called the mystical tablet. I know it's called, like it's got the word tablet. The something tablet, I'm very sure that it's the mystical tablet book. So this is my weekly reward for today, for this week. Library stamp. This has gone down in value <clears throat> and I've already got one of these so I think I'm going to be re-rolling for a fifth day in a row. 710, alright so it's more expensive than the last time I checked I think. <clears throat> I mean, every day I'm missing out on profit, so I probably should just take this so that I can earn profit from restocking for seven days. Because I have a minimum target per day of at least 100,000 Neo Points profit from restocking every day. So each day that I re roll the weekly reward, I'm missing out on 100,000 profit from restocking. And if I re-roll this today, it's half a million profit from restocking items at the Neopian shops that I'm missing out on. So this is a big decision. I don't know what to do. I probably should take this item. And then if I take this item, 700,000 Neo points, then I'll be able to make 800, 900, 1 million, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1 million 400 Neo points in total, including profit from restocking items and it's half price day today and I can make back some of the profit that I've missed out on the past few days, the past four days that I've re-rolled the weekly reward. I just really want to re-roll and get the spring gift basket. I'm not sure what to do, I think I probably should accept this and just sell it Hopefully it will stay at this price, or increase, but not drop. I'm thinking, I'm leaning towards just accepting this, because each day I re-roll, if I re-roll today, it's going to be five days in a row. That's like a minimum of 500,000 Neo points profit from restocking that I've missed out on. And the spring gift basket, I think, is worth like two and a half million Neo points, so it's not far off. And the only reason I want to have the spring gift basket as my weekly reward is to sell it. But when I think about it, it's not really far off what I'm what I would get if I accept this as my daily reward, as my weekly reward. It's a very difficult situation, a very difficult decision to make. Uh, if I re-roll 
tomorrow I could get a spring gift basket or the Myst mystical tablet book but I could get a really cheap prize ah this is tricky I don't know I think I'm going to accept this as my weekly reward post in the comments on this video what you think I should have done if I made the right decision I don't know exactly how much the tablet book is and yeah the spring gift basket there's a chance I won't win it and if I re-roll today that's five days in a row then if I re-roll tomorrow because it's a cheap pri uh, prize yeah reward and then the day after that and the day after that it's missing out on neo points that could have just like ended up totaling the the total amount of neo points that the spring gift basket costs. I don't think I should take a chance re-rolling this because I'm probably gonna end up this video quickly because somebody came into the room that I was recording this video in. Um yeah, I think I'm gonna just accept this. I'm going to check my inventory first, I think, to see if I've got one of these stamps already. And I think I should probably just accept this reward. I think it's the most expensive reward that I've been offered so far in the past four days, five days, including today. I'm very sure that I bought some of these to invest in. Did I? Three of them. Yeah. Yeah, I think I will accept this weekly reward. Because every day I don't accept the weekly reward, I'm missing out on profit. And I don't want to keep missing out on profit from restocking. Yep, okay. Yeah, I'll do that then. Alright, I've made my decision. I don't know if it's the right decision, but I've made my decision. I can't keep re-rolling. There's a chance that I might get a cheap prize tomorrow. I think there's a bigger chance that I'll get a cheap prize tomorrow. Or it could work out that because I've got so many cheap prizes, tomorrow's prize could be expensive. I'm going to go on Jelly Neo's uh, quest log guide to see the prices of the items. I'm going to pause this video. Okay, so I'm on the quest log guide on Jelly Neo's website. So there's this paintbrush that's approximately 1 million Neo points. Lost as a paintbrush, nearly one. So many stamp, one and a half probably. This is the one I'll bring back. Yeah, this is the most expensive reward, I think. And that looks like it's dropped a bit, like from two and a half million to one million seven hundred and fifty thousand. One million more expensive than the item I've been with. Fleet Rock could do with no sleep in I've put a sleep ray to base on on half fourteen. That's one million approximately. It's worth the item that that's the thing. If it's worth one million neo points, it's only three hundred thousand neo points away. The mystical tablet that's dropped in value as well. Toy paintbrush. Yeah, I think I will accept it. That's what I'm going to do. Uh, 
Okay, yep, that's my decision. I'm going to buy an item at the Healing Springs and accept this weekly reward the Labrae stamp. So I won't be re-rolling my weekly reward for a fifth day in a row. Alright, I bought it. I clicked. Alright, so that's one task done. I don't know if it was the right decision, but I've already made my decision. Spin the Wheel of Knowledge, play a classic game. Alright, so I'm going to complete these tasks and claim my rewards. That's the end of this video. Thank you for watching MNEO Points. Let me know in the comments if you think I made the right decision or not. It would help as well if you knew what items I have re-rolled in the past. So I'm going to pause this video again and open Jelly Neo's quest log guide. <clears throat> Okay, so I'm on Jelinio's quest guide again. So the items that I've re-rolled yesterday was the tonic drink, purplum tonic, that one. So that was worth approximately 12,500 now. That's a lot of the Larry Sand. Um, There was the drum charm, 400,000. <clears throat> that was the day of yesterday. There was the esophageal touch. And that's a cheap item as well. I ended up buying that for under Super Shop Wizard for my Wanted Woods Gallery. And there was this item. Which is an item. So the main the um, was the drum charm, I think. Okay, so this video, thank you for watching. How many points?